Hey guys, it's Kate from HealthyFashion.com and I'm back for this week's Friday Five. I got a lot of great feedback on last week's post, so I'm excited to share with you all uh, this week some of my favorite uh, household products. So we'll go ahead and get started. Up first we have my dishwasher gel. Um, I've tried lots of natural products in the dishwash detergent um, department and this is of all of them my favorite. It's by Earth, Fin Earth Friendly Products. Um, it's our two-time ultra high efficiency wave 100% all natural auto dishwasher gel with built-in rinse aid. Um, flavor or scent, I guess, is um, free and clear. So this is what it looks like. Um, it's made from plants. It's free of 1,4-dioxane phosphates and it's pH neutral. So I know that's a mouthful, but um, it's a really, really great product. Um, of all the natural products I've used, it's the only one that gets my dishes sparkling clean. Um, it doesn't have any weird scent either, which kind of bothers me on some of the dish detergents. They smell like soap. Um, this is very clear, clean. Um, you just basically pop the top off, pour in enough to fill up your little square in your dishwasher, and go. So this is, like I said, by um, Earth Friendly Products, and it's amazing. If you see it, check it out. That's my dish dishwasher detergent. Um, number two, we're going to do another product by them. Um, any of their products that I've tried are amazing so far. Uh, the earth friendly products. They're all 1,4-dioxane free. They're 100% natural. Um, this one's made with coconut oil and it's their dish um, dish soap, I guess, for when you're washing dishes by hand. Uh, the flavor is natural grapefruit. I've tried all the flavors and they're great. Um, I like the almond the best. Um, but this one's made basically water, coconut oil, grapefruit oil, I mean, how much cleaner and, and more natural can you get? Like I said, smells great, works great. Never had a problem with it not cleaning my dishes well. And these are like three bucks. So it's almost competitive, competitive with um, the normal stuff. So you don't have to worry about spending any more money either. Um, and like I said, this is uh, Earth Friendly Products. They're Ultra Dish Mate um, Dishwashing Liquid Cleaner. So that is number two. Number three is another product I use for my dishwasher that I really like. This is a powder. The um, reason I bought this was because it was on sale and I actually fell in love with it. Um, so I kind of rotate between these two, you know, whatever's on sale or whatever I see at the store that day. But this is their um, Ecological Automatic Dishwasher Powder. Um, again, plant-based, made from minerals using powders of nature. Um, ingredients here are oxygen, uh, chlorine-free bleach, sodium disoclate, polypeptides, magnesium, silicate, enzymes, sugar derivatives, um, sodium phosphate, sodium bicarbonate, non-ionic sugar, and um, sodium bicarbonate. So good stuff again. Um, no animal testing. It's very biodegradable. Um, this scent is again free and clear, so it's not gonna make you sick. Um, and this stuff's great too. It's 38 loads, and I think this is like $5.99 or $6. So affordable. And this is um, by Ecover. So if you see it, check it out and let me know what you think. So number four, um, I'm moving through these pretty quick today. It's pretty easy, not much to say about them. Um, this is a product I got from Tropical Traditions. And Tropical Traditions is one of my favorite places to order online. They have just about everything from coconut oil to beauty products, hair products, um, beef, anything. And this is their uh, dish liquid. It's free of fragrances, dyes, petroleum solvents, and respiratory and skin irritants. I like this because it's a gallon. So. Um, I do go through quite a bit of dish soap in my house, cleaning dishes um, from all the cooking I do. So this is a very um, economical way to buy. And also you're reducing your waste with, you know, buying the one big container. You're not, you know, throwing out a ton of plastic. I actually save these ones and refill them with this stuff whenever I run out. So um, this one doesn't have a scent either. And I'm pretty sure it's made from coconut oil. Um, oh, deionized water, coconut, sugar-based cleaning, sudsing agents, surfactants, and emulsifiers. So all good stuff. Again, works great. I've never had a problem with it not cleaning my dishes. And um, I think this is like 25 or 30 bucks, so it keeps you busy for a while. So this is uh, Tropical Traditions, and it, it's their dish liquid. It's a little heavy. Um, all right, so then last but not least, uh, we'll wrap up today with uh, my favorite hand soap. This is what I use in my kitchen. Um, this is by Everyday Shea, and it's a shea butter uh, foaming hand soap with lavender. It's handmade by Alfalfa. Um, it's fair trade. Ingredients are shea butter, um, shea leaf, extract, neem leaf, um, some oils, coconut oil, lavender essential oil, and xanthan gum. It's gluten-free. 
Um, again, like I said in my last video, what you put on your skin is what you put in your body. So even soaps, you want to really watch, you know, all of the propylene glycol, the sodium lauryl sulfate. Try and avoid that. And this stuff smells great. It's very refreshing. It's got the lavender. Um, the shea butter is nice and soft, so it makes your hands smooth. And um, it works great. So I think I got this at Whole Foods. It's like $6. Um, hand soap's one of those things I find that are a bit pricey in the natural department. So, um, but, you know, it, you it lasts a while. This one foams, so it's kind of fun. And... You know, you're doing a great thing for your body by purchasing these products. So let me know if you tried any of these. Let me know what you use. Um, if you haven't made the switch to natural products, please do so. Um, it'll change your life. And you can really find good quality uh, products that work just as well as the traditional stuff for, um, you know, a couple dollars more maybe. But it's totally worth the investment in your health and your life. So leave me some comments. Let me know if you tried any of these um, or what you've tried, what you love. And we will see you all next week. So have a good weekend. Bye-bye.